Hi everyone. Uh, today we are going to see STO return PO in SAP. And before creating the PO, we'll see the what are the configurations are required for this. So here uh, I have already created you no know, vendor master and customer master for this. So let me uh, show you in a table. Okay, I have already created. So, in uh, customer master, we need to assign the you know, supplying plant BP. And go to change this. Sorry. Look at here. I have uh, S and here supplying plant for this customer master and CP condition and everything. So let me see other configurations. I have to go purchasing view. Confirmation. Uh, define internal confirmation categories. Click on here. Here we need to assign your uh, delivery type, EL, inbound delivery. And then uh, here EL, R, and EL, and click on, you know, on this, and save this and come back and uh, click on setup confirmation control i'm going to create new one inbound delivery for intercompany make a new entry la Okay, I've, I've configured the confirmations uh, for the STOPO. Sorry, confirmation control for the STOPO. And then we have to configure STO settings. Go to the purchase order. Uh, click on your Define uh, shipping data for the plants. My here, my supply plant 7010. Now I have assigned the customer master and distribution channel division and uh, uh, sales or sales organization for this for sending plant and as well as receiving plant. Also, this is the my receiving plant. Okay, and here, uh, configure delivery type availability check of uh, procedure by plant. Click on your Make a new entry. Document type is the UB2. Supplying plant 7010. And document type will be LLR. And click on your here also assign the LLR. And UB2 7020 LLR. And save this. And then go to your click on store return, return plant to plant. So you be to supply plant. You have to assign your uh, delivery type returns LLR, LLR. Save this. And then go to your click on uh, activate advanced 
return management for the purchase order types. Click on here. So UB2, it's already activated. Yeah. And and after we need to check SPRO. Click on here, then go to shipping. Click on, uh, click on uh, basic thing, uh, basic uh, shipping functions. Click on uh, expand it. Click on here. Enter your plant 7010. Assign your store location shipping point for uh, respective plants. Close this. And click on deliveries. And click on here. Check your uh, delivery type will be LLR. Yeah, it's already maintained. Yes, now I'm going to create the output uh, condition record. NS here. And it will be the output type of this. Uh, okay, speed. Click on enter and uh, enter the delivery type LLR executed. I already saved. Look at here. Partner function will be the SH, and you have to save this. And now I'm going to create the PO, but I already created the material master. I'm not explaining that. So if you want to see, I can show you that. Is metal master existing on both plant? Look at here. Yeah. Now I'm going to create the PO. Document type will be UB2. Enter your supplying plant and you'll see the extra tab will come here. Enter the material master and here confirmation control uh, is the mandatory. Enter your receiving, uh, you know, receiving plant. Enter the store location and here confirmation control key is the mandatory. Press enter. And what I created this one, right? The press enter and see the you know, shipping tab you can see the delivery type llr and then save this okay uh i have i need to display this view okay this is the my view uh go to header click on returns for view okay so only few are only created it. So I'm going to do the outbound delivery for this. Sorry. Enter the purchase order number. Okay. Now re repress it. Look at this outbound delivery as created. Now I'm going to do the you know PGI. Click on liquid quantity and click on PGI. And after done the PGI, you will uh, you'll get the you know you'll uh, uh, we'll see the inbound delivery in PO. 
before that i need to display this go to express oh and here uh, here some errors are there so i need to click on process log what is error so okay i got the error error during copy of uh, partner function partner uh, partner role vm so okay so i have to go to the spro mg and click on here and then go to service parts and uh, the service parts management uh click on complaints and returns click on define a vendor uh, vendor per store location and select your plants enter your uh, your uh, sales organization distribution channel 16.7010 division vendor master and customer master same just copy all okay and this is 7020 my second point for the plan two and save this now i'll go again vl0 to n press enter okay go to express sorry i have to go vl 03n go to express so so i'll create another pivot let me check because i'm getting dumping here dump here so create another pivot Enter the confirmation control key. Seven thousand and save this. Copy this PO. Display the PO. Yeah. Now I'm going to do. Outbound delivery. Sorry, I might open many. VL ten B. Okay, now replace the PO. Go to header, click on your look at this outbound delivery has created, and then after we need to do the goods issue. Click on quantity and click on PGA okay now you press the PO. look at this your pga also completed now we need to create the inbound delivery look at this so inbound delivery 
might be created. So let me check output uh, of the outbound delivery. Go to this page. Go to Express. Go to Delivery Output. Click on Header. Look at this. It's success now. That means inbound delivery has created. Now go to the PO. Just come back from here. We can see the confirmation control. Under the confirmation control, we can see the inbound delivery. Yes, look at here. In Mondela has created, and then we need to. And now we have to go here. We have to do the uh, now we have to receive the good receipt with reference to the VL sorry, inbound delivery VL 32 and enter that inbound delivery. Sorry. And click on P, uh, post goods receipt. Sorry, I haven't entered the store location for this. So enter and click on post food receipt. Now go and check the PO. Okay, look at here. Six uh, six seventy one. The moment has updated. And you can see the tab also. Sorry, uh, you know, history of the uh, retrieval. Thank you all.